If you saw our video about replacing our tow bar, you know that binding was one of the main reasons we upgraded. On anything but a straight level surface, our old tow bar would sometimes require two people and a fair amount of effort to disconnect. Roadmaster asked us to put their Sterling all-terrain tow bar through its paces, and we promised to update you on how it's been performing. In a word, it's been awesome, allowing one of us to disconnect the car all alone in just about any situation. Tow bar binding is only a problem when disconnecting the car, not when hooking up. If you're able to park straight and level, just about any tow bar will release easily. But if you ever have to disconnect on a hill or turn, binding can be a real problem for most tow bars. Facing downhill, gravity presses the weight of the car forward toward the RV, causing the release handles on our old tow bar to bind. The patented latch on our Roadmaster creates a 400 to 1 force ratio, allowing us to release it easily, even on a steep downhill. Just set the car's parking brake, release the handles, and disconnect. No problem. Disconnecting on a turn with the car at an angle to the RV also caused our old tow bar to bind. And of course, if we were both downhill and at an angle, it could be extremely difficult to unhook the car, even with a helper. In testing our Roadmaster, we've tried hard to make it bind, purposely challenging it in the most difficult situations, like the tightest possible angle on a downhill slope. No matter what we do, it releases easily every time without any binding. This tow bar continues to impress us. What about facing uphill? Binding doesn't occur with any tow bar when you're facing straight uphill because gravity pulls the car down the hill away from the RV, allowing the handles to release freely even without Roadmaster's patented freedom latch. But the weight of the car pulling downhill can pinch the pins that connect the car to the tow bar. That's not tow bar binding, that's just gravity and physics. So here's how we disconnect the car on an uphill grade with just one person. Hop behind the wheel and snug the car forward, pressing against the tow bar, and set the parking brake. Then release the handles and disconnect as usual. Even if we press the car very firmly against the tow bar, the freedom latches on our Roadmaster will release easily. Of course, we disconnect on straight level surfaces when we can, but when it's not possible to do that, we still have no problem, and our Roadmaster has yet to bind in any situation, no matter how hard we've tried. We're loving our new tow bar, and we'll continue testing it and updating you as we go. If you like our videos, please leave a comment or give a thumbs up. And be sure to check out more of our RVing content at thervgeeks.com. Thanks for watching.